I welcome all of you on the platform of your PD education and uh, congratulations to all of you those who have got uh, written exam cleared those who have cleared their written exam and now they have got the interview call for their engineering services uh, exam so this is very prestigious job for engineers and uh, you know after this uh, seeds of railways where railways has withdrawn the seeds from engineering services the exam examination level has become even tough uh, after that so uh, really appreciate the effort by all of you who have uh, gone for this exam and uh, cleared their written also and now going for personality test or interview uh, test interview is all about you know your personality what kind of person you are your attitude uh, so they will try to know uh, about you by asking couple of questions from you and those questions can be related to your personality and uh, these questions can be related to technical domain also so it's a combination of these two because majority of engineering services jobs are techno managerial jobs so uh, you are supposed to uh, know all these things how engineering services uh, interview or personality test is different from public sector in public sector normally uh, he ask you hr question and technical question but uh, in engineering services he tends to ask you current related topic also uh, which are relevant for you so he may ask you even uh, you know topics like if you are from uttar pradesh he may ask you also about you know elections going on there or uh, the policy of the government on population or uh, you know age of uh, girls mar uh, marriageable age increase uh, is that right decision or wrong decision so they can ask you uh, current related topics also so how best way to prepare for engineering services is that you should have some knowledge about current issues also which are relevant to you not all the issues it is not a civil services or administrative services uh, interview it is engineering services so some issues related to you especially related to the domain of economy or uh, your area so something like that or technology those questions can be asked to you and then hr related questions and then technical questions now uh, the best way to prepare uh, this interview is like somebody ask you so many questions uh, like different kind of questions are asked to you you have a dedicated copy and more than 200 question you have to write in your copy which can be asked to you and you should know the answer when i'm saying this 200 question i'm not talking about the technical question technical is different technical though you have prepared and they will ask you technical questions so uh, you should have 200 question related to hr personality and current related things so now your pedia is geared up to prepare you for that and uh, how we will do that is many of you already know about the you know interview preparation modules and guidance of your pedia for public sectors so technical snaps technical mocks keep on going our mentors keep on asking you those questions and on the panel of your pedia you have lot of technical snaps which will be helpful for you uh, to learn so there's a learning content also and then practice content also unlimited hrs you should do with me uh, uh, on the basis of your detailed application form uh, whatever information you have provided and related to you so the moment you start answering you start introducing yourself then next impromptu questions will come and then you have to write after every hr you have to write couple of questions which are relevant to you not only knowledge you should know but the flow is also very important hindi english is not a problem in upsc now you can answer in hindi also so where we should work is like content what questions can come we should predict that okay sir ye question aayega and then the content we have to write this is the answer for that and then after that content we need to uh, maintain our flow because even if i give you in writing four sentences uh, that you answer this way unless until you practice your flow will not be maintained you have to be confident you have to be calm you have to be straightforward and you have to be honest in the interview that is what they appreciate and then you know officer like qualities which obviously uh, you can acquire also uh, if you start simulating that you are an officer in engineering services something like that so let's start preparing so uh, there is entire module in place uh, in your pdn now for preparing you for engineering services ups engineering services exam you are very close just hit the last stage and you are ies officer all the very best let's start preparing together now thank you